Can we do a story of a woman who got successful through something other than divorce or inheritance? Yeah, I think we can. I guess one caveat to bear in mind is that I think there are very few people in history generally who are successful without inheriting something. It's pretty hard to invent something new if you're a child who can't read or write and you've got to do another 12-hour shift at the box factory. Eleanor Code, a hundred years before women got the vote, ran her own factory making something called code stone. See, at that time, the upper class had a bit of a problem. They loved covering their houses in little decorations and crests and statues like this, but real stone weathers really badly, especially in the London smog. It also needs to be quarried and then transported because it's really heavy, that costs a lot of money, it's a big faff. What Eleanor Code did was make fake stone factory made artificial stone. And with it you can make all sorts of fancy statues, like this adorable lion on Westminster Bridge. And she was really successful. Her factory made stuff for Buckingham Palace and Brighton Pavilion and Windsor Castle. There were other artificial stones on the market before hers, but hers blew everything else out of the water and she came up with the recipe and she came up with the kiln firing process. 